All right, good morning, everybody. Welcome back. All right, it's Bren here. Um, and uh, woke up this morning. It's the last day of February, right? And we have ourselves some snow coverage. All right, nothing too crazy though. And I could tell throughout the night when I took a peek out the window that it wasn't gonna be anything serious. I knew it was gonna be very light coverage. So it's gonna be easy work. Just brushing off the snow. There's no need for shoveling anything. Um, I'm going to put on my snow boots. Had a great night's sleep, you know. Usually I would run the car right now. It's pretty cold in here, but it's not It's not too bad. It's about 30 degrees. With When it's snowing outside, you want to be careful when you run the engine because you don't know if your exhaust pipe is, is blocked in any way. I highly doubt that mine is. In fact, I, I doubt it so much. I'm gonna flip the engine on right now. All right. All right, we're about to head outside. Mm. Grab this guy right here. Mm. I've only had to use this once this winter so far, which is a bummer because I love this thing. Um, but, um, yeah, so you want to be careful if it's like a heavy storm to not run the engine when uh, there's a possibility of the exhaust being blocked because that's how you get carbon monoxide poisoning, you know what I'm saying? Or at least that's that's what I know of, right? So anyways, we're going to head outside here. We're going to take a look. It's still snowing just a little bit. We're going to clean off the car, see where we stand for the day. Let's go. A little bit of snow falling here. Look at this. Yeah, so see what I'm saying? My exhaust points down. It's covered by the car, so that's a good thing for my exhaust. So wasn't too concerned about that. But yeah, we got something. We got a little something. Take them boots out. Okay. Red nose. All right. That's good enough for me. It's still snowing out, so we're still gonna have some accumulation, but as soon as we get on the road, we'll just let the car work itself out. But we got all the heavy snow off the roof and stuff, and it wasn't that heavy. It wasn't that light though, either. Um, it looked a lot lighter from the inside this morning when I got out I saw it was a little bit heavier but um, it's supposed to continue snowing all throughout the day it's supposed to stop around five or six uh, so we'll see what kind of work today is gonna bring usually it's very busy when it's snowing and uh, yeah that wasn't too bad at all so I don't know about you I'm in the mood for a bit of a workout some stretching and a nice hot shower and uh, definitely a nice hot cup of coffee. And uh, then we're gonna start our work day and uh, see what kind of money we can make. Let's move it. 
to it. Let's go. So the old Subaru, she's no stranger to uh, snowstorms and icy roads and all that jazz. So uh, it's one of the reasons why I love this car is the all-wheel drive and it handles very well in winter conditions. Um, but this isn't a Subaru commercial, so let's just let's just keep it moving. <laughs> those right now okay here we are leaving the Walmart parking lot okay and uh, like a few other Walmart parking lots that I camp out at got a plan of fitness right here so I don't have to drive too far to get that morning workout slash shower, you know? Very convenient right now. Look at this, look at this. Planet Fitness right there to my left. Not many people here, which is great. I have the whole place to myself. Whip it in right here.
we're back in the car. Listen, I spent like an hour and 30 minutes in that gym. Uh, it was really nice. Had the whole place to myself. Um, got a nice workout in. Sat in the massage chair. Took like a 20 minute shower. Don't know, just felt like doing it. And then, um, you know, freshened up. I think I'm gonna switch on the apps. See if we can get something going. See what kind of mood the apps are in today to see if it's busy. Uh, at some point we're gonna get a coffee though. So let's switch on some apps and get to work. All right, we got our first order of the day for Starbucks. Let's go grab it. Enjoy your snowy day. All right guys, so I'm gonna go into gig mode here. So I'm not gonna be doing too much talking for a little bit. I just wanna focus on work and uh, get these orders. So let's hope we can make some good money today. You're, you're awesome, thank you. Appreciate you. All Starbucks, two with Uber Eats, one with DoorDash. All right, let's go get it. All right, so this Starbucks is actually right by the UPS store where I get my mail. So I'm actually gonna pick up that mail while I'm here, which is awesome. This is something I wanted to do today anyways. So we'll get that done, then we'll go pick up the order. I'm excited because I am picking up a package that I ordered last week today, and it's a bit of a mystery box. I will share with you what it is later in the video, but I'm kind of excited. my favorite gig app Grubhub Uber Eats or DoorDash and uh, I'd probably have to go with Grubhub uh, because uh, orange you know what I mean I, I just love the color orange and I love their orange branding and I love oranges so I'd have to go with Grubhub all right so I'm on my way to drop off this uh, Uber Eats order but DoorDash comes through with this offer right here it says $11.75 but they hide the mileage and I you know it's so tricky so sneaky of them to do that you know because you've no idea how far you're gonna have to drive to deliver this order so that's just an instant decline if I can't see the miles I'm not even thinking about it okay I can't wait any longer let me show you what I ordered off of eBay for six dollars so you'll know that I use this little bowl in my mini rice cooker. It gets very hot. And sometimes I, I like to skip the process of putting the food into a paper bowl. I just like to eat straight out of this, right? But this gets so hot. I said to myself, hmm, self, I need a bowl warmer. You know, something that you can put around it, almost like a cozy that you can put around it. I found one, but that's not all. It's not just any cozy ladies and gentlemen. Are you getting excited? Because I am. I hope it fits. Go ahead and get that knife out real quick. Bang. Get that knife out in this mop. There it is. There it is. Introducing the new edition. Boys. I got to get the boys for this. All right, I got my boys. I'm just gonna put these guys right down here. Very good. Wait till, you, wait till you guys see this. 
Here we go. <laughs> I found a Ninja Turtle themed cozy bowl holder. What do you guys think of that? Huh? Look at this. All the boys, what are you guys thinking? Huh? Gotta get back to work here. Okay, so check that out. I'll be able to, you know, do my thing without burning my hands off Ninja Turtle style. All right, let's get back to work. take a little uh, lunch break here guys because um, I'm hungry I picked up myself a sandwich at Starbucks it's a um, ham and Swiss I got my Dunkin coffee bit of a conflicting lunch here but it'll do so um, we had some action this morning, but not as busy as I thought it was going to be, to be honest with you. I thought I'd be off to a much quicker start, but it's okay because it's still, it's only 11 o'clock really, you know? So we've got time to make it happen. I might do some work on the laptop as well. So I want to show you what I'm working on right now. I'm working on the thumbnail for this video. And so far it's turned out really cool. Let me show you. Okay, so I make my um, thumbnails in Canva. I'm not sure if you guys are familiar with this website. It's a graphic design website. I'm not going to say it's easy to use because it took me a while to figure it out. But by this point, I'm an expert on Canva. So anyways, this is the thumbnail for this video. Snow day. Isn't that cool? And actually, this is not, this This wasn't one shot. This was actually two pictures. See this one right here? That's a separate picture. I just, I just removed the background, right? And I put it right here like this, see? And then for the text, um, you know, you can select your different fonts here and you can also change the effects um, you know, they're like all the color effects and stuff like that, you know, I like the blue though. So, you know, you can, um, change the lines. It's pretty cool. So yeah, a little behind the scenes action there. So I wanted to take a second. All right. I wanted to take a second to thank all of you for watching my videos. Um, for subbing to the channel, for leaving comments, uh, for helping me get closer and closer to monetization, all right? We just passed 900 subs, guys. This is amazeballs, and I want to thank you guys. And if you're new to the channel, welcome, all right? Welcome on board. If you would like to know the best and easiest way to support this channel, here's how to do so. Like the video, leave a comment, even if it's a smiley face, hell, it could be a poop emoji. Just leave something down there. Or you could subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. If you're one of those folks who reached out to me and said, Brent, how can I throw you a few bucks? You know what I mean? How can I support the channel monetarily? If, if you'd like to do that, first of all, thank you for even thinking about that. But if you would like to support the channel monetarily, you could do that two ways. One, through my Venmo, which is right here. Two, through my PayPal, which is right here. All right, I don't have a Patreon or anything like that set up just yet, but those are the two ways that you could support this channel monetarily. Throw me a buck or two. 
um, consider it a virtual tip jar for my videos. Uh, that's a good way of looking at it. So that's how you can do it. I appreciate you guys. Let's get back to the video. Okay, guys, you got to get a load of this. I just checked the DoorDash app. They are doing a peak pay right now, $4.50 added on to each delivery that we accept. This is nuts, all right? Check out this order I just got after seeing that. $22, five miles. All right, it's a double pickup, but I'm all about it. Let's see how much we can get out of this. Thank you, I appreciate it. Have a good day. You too. All right, second cash tip of the day. I don't know how much is in there, but uh, feels good. All right, look at this banger from Uber Eats. $21.15 for 8.4 miles. Today's gonna be a good day. Let's go get it. This one's going to some college students. Let's hope they're not baiting me with this tip because that happens every once in a while on, on Uber Eats, you know, they'll bait you with a tip because they don't confirm the tip until after the delivery has been made. Unlike DoorDash and Grubhub, the tip is already there. So, uh, what are we gonna do about it, huh? Let's just hope for the best. All right, so I just made that delivery. Fine young gentleman. So I have reason to believe that that tip will actually come through for me. You can kind of just tell with interactions with people, and I think I'm all set for that one. So, and I landed in a good spot too. So um, I'll likely get another order here in just a second. So I've decided to call it. It's eight o'clock. I'm hungry and I would like to just relax at this point. 
Uh, I'm not quite sure just how much I made, but I know I blew past my goal, uh, my daily goal. So we'll talk about that in a second. But just so happens there's a Walmart right here, um, right across the street from where I did my last delivery. So this is perfect. We're just gonna set up shop. I've slept in this Walmart once before, so not too concerned about it, you know? We'll get as stealthy as we can here, all right? And then we'll chat. Okay, there are some campers here for sure. I'm just gonna post up right next to this guy. So I'm gonna do the trick. All right, how about some car life magic? You ready? Let's do this. Okay, here we are in the red light lounge. This is where I want it to be, you know, time to make some dinner. As you can see, I'm cooking some dinner right now. Um, some whole grain penne. I've got some uh, plant-based sausage. I have some salsa in here, spinach, garlic, and butter and it's gonna be quite tasty. I'll show you what it looks like when it's done. But anyways, let's talk about today. Today was a good day. Thanks for working with me today. Give yourselves a hand, give yourselves a hand. So the daily goal every day is 150. Um, we blew past that today. We made $208. Uh, I made roughly around $90 with DoorDash. I uh, pulled in about $80 with Uber Eats and then a nice little 35 bucks with Grubhub for a total of 208 roughly. Okay, so I'm happy with that number. I'm happy with that number. Um, and it's still early enough to where I can enjoy the evening. So I'm gonna make some dinner, then I'm gonna watch some Netflix. I'm watching Rocky V right now. Um, I ran through all the Rocky movies this week, all right? One through five in build up to Creed 3 because my son and I are going to see Creed 3 for my birthday on Saturday. And yes, my birthday's tomorrow, March 1st, uh, just in case anyone's wondering. But um, um, I'll be hanging out with my son tomorrow a little bit, but we're gonna have a boys' night out on Saturday. I booked a room at the Marriott and um, we're just gonna do our thing. So I'm really looking forward to that. Uh, but anyways, let's finish cooking. I'll show you what this looks like. And uh, also, we're gonna see how this thing works. I hope it doesn't burn through this thing. I guess we'll find out. All right, let's see what we got going on in here. Oh yes. This is my favorite dish. It really is. Now I could have made more, but I'm actually not as hungry tonight. So this will be perfect. All right. Bang, bang, bang. Powered up by our buddy. Uh, the Jackery. All right, we're gonna turn that off. That's about done. All right, there we go. That's about done. I'll just give it a minute and then we'll take it out and we're gonna throw that bowl right into this puppy and see how it works. Okay, look at this thing. It fits perfectly. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna steal a bite right here. Okay. Mmm. That is good. All right, so I'm about to get down with my bad self, with my ninja self right now. Mmm. We're gonna watch some Rocky, finish our dinner. Folks, thanks for joining me today. As always, I appreciate you guys for watching, and until next time, take it easy.